It was stuck on top of a giant ant! Go, Jetters. Are you okay? For now. But it's not safe being small anymore. Can you grab the size ray and make us big? Easy there. Sorry, Go, Jetters. No can do. I can't get to the size ray. Then we need click-ons. You got it, Go Jetters. Time for a mix to fix that glitch. Geo Giant. Geo Grab. I'll go find Uncle Glitch, and we'll find the size ray. Tiny go jetters. No! Extinct! Extinct! Whoa! Cayenne, what's up? I can't believe the dodo is extinct. There are none left in the world at all. Not even one. Hey, what's all the noise, go jetters? The dodo is extinct, and we never got to see one. It's sad news, go jetters. And more animals could become extinct, too. Huh? There are lots of different animals around the world that need help to survive because there are hardly any of them left. The Sumatran tiger, the giant panda, the mountain gorilla, the North Atlantic right whale. So many different animals. Uh, but why? Hmm. Mostly it's because where they live becomes damaged or changed so much that it's hard for them to survive. Uh. But there are people who work really hard to look after animals and their environment, like the conservationists in the pristine forests of Sao Paulo, Brazil. What animal are they helping? The black lion tamarind. We can pay them a visit. Then you can all see what's being done to stop the black lion tamarind from becoming extinct. Yeah! Yeah. Did you hear that, Grimbots? Black lions that need our help. Oh, why do I always have to explain everything? I, the Great Grandmaster Glitch, will save these black lion thingies. Well, don't you stand there. Take me to the pristine forest of Sao Paulo. <laughs> what does pristine mean? Well, uh, pristine means... Oh, yes. Right. <clears throat> pristine means clean. Ugh, that sounds terrible. Uh, oh, well, nobody said being a lion saver would be easy. To Sao Paulo! Grimots, let's go! Oh, I've missed this place. Right, step where I step, and don't touch anything. Silly no jetter! It's safe in here! I think I'd remember if I'd set any booby traps in my own secret run! Great! Now what? I'm pretty sure there's a switch to open the door somewhere. I just need to remember where. Uh, quick! We're running out of time! Ah! Uh, there's no release switch anywhere in here! <gasps> That's it! It's not in here! It's out there! 
<laughs> oh, not that switch! The one next to it! All right! <laughs> Aced it! Now, what are we gonna do for a present? I don't know. There's just a load of old memories from when we were cadets. <gasps> I've, I've got, got an, an idea! idea. <laughs> <laughs> Urgent warning. Ubercorn arriving in three, two, one. We got it! Surprise! Surprise! <laughs> Whoa! Happy birthday! I... I didn't even know you knew it was my birthday. How did you do all this without me noticing? Oh, it was easy! Thanks to a little bit of help from Jetpad and Glitch, of course. Thank you, thank you. Well, this is amazing. Wow, all my memories from my time as a cadet. <laughs> oh, look at my hair. <laughs> with the clock ticking, Fogg left London, England with his assistant, Passepartout. Passepartout was a fantastic gymnast, just like Kyan. Awesome! I like this story already. So what happened next? Phileas and Passepartout took a steam train through Europe, then a boat to Egypt and the Suez Canal, a special waterway built to link two seas together. What did I tell you, Passepartout? Train plus boat equals London to Egypt in exactly seven days. You aced it, Mr. Fogg. And the Suez Canal will save us a long trip around Africa. Two tickets for the next boat coming right up. Excuse me, Ace Detective Inspector Fix coming through. I'm on the trail of a thief who robbed the Bank of England. Mm -mm. Oh. <laughs> Have you seen this man? Well, he looks a little like my friend Phileas Fogg, but he's no bank robber. Sorry, I have to go. <laughs> well, close enough. Inspector Fix always gets his man. Triples, they're getting away! Quickly! I need a boat! Follow that robber! Phileas Fogg wasn't a bank robber, was he? No, but brave Inspector Fix thought he was, and he followed him all the way from Egypt to India. Phileas planned to take a train right across the country, but the railway wasn't finished. They were stuck deep in the jungle. No cars, no planes, and now no train either. What did they do? They went by elephant. Elephant? But they're beautiful wild animals. You can't ride them. People did in those days. Elephants carried supplies and people too. <sighs> Thank you. We really need this ride. We're happy to help. Come on, Trunkster. Let's go. <laughs> What else do you remember about your holidays with Maria? Well, we used to play guitar, explore for hours, and then we always ate churros. Churros? They're a type of pastry. Maria and I used to get them from a favorite churro stall. <laughs> she always used to pinch the last one. Maybe that could be another clue. Jetpad, where can we find some churros? Churros are a delicious treat. Available all over Spain. Oh, maybe that's not a good clue after all. And now I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Approaching Sierra de Grazalema. Wow, this park is huge. Ergo, we need more clues. <laughs> Furs are even more beautiful than I remember. Hmm. See anything that reminds you of Maria's town? Not yet, but let's keep looking. <laughs> Zuli? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Maria and I made a swing just like this. <laughs> Is this a clue? No. But that climbing equipment might be. I remember something. Follow those stories. <laughs> yes, another clue. Canyoning. I always.
always imagined it would feel just like flying. But we were too young and too nervous to try it. I can see why. <laughs> oh, this feels good. <laughs> the old dream team back together. Just like when we were cadets. Ooh. Remember that Antarctic mission I piloted so expertly? I sure do. Especially the way you, uh, <laughs> landed on that iceberg. Uh, yes, well, ooh, ah, look how brilliantly I captained our Atlantic sailing mission. Nothing got in our way. Apart from that island. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry. I'll make sure this mission goes nice and smoothly. No, I will. These are my precious seeds from my rare fruit tree, planted by great grandfather Glitch herself. Ah. So I'm in charge of getting them safely to. Uh, where are we going again? Sounds like you need some funky facts. Yow! Funky facts! Funky facts! Let me tell you about the place we're at. We're on our way to the Svalbard Global Seed Vault, a special place where seeds from plants all around the world are stored. We need plants for food, like rice, wheat, and corn. But sometimes these crops can be destroyed. If that happens, farmers can grow new ones by planting seeds from the vault. The seeds have to be kept cold so they don't go off. The vault was built inside a snowy mountain, which acts like a giant freezer and keeps the seeds safe. Oh, facts. Ah, weren't those facts fabulously funky little seeds? Now, let's get you safely to your new home. Oh, oh, gotcha. and strengthens the others. Bridge minus diagonal supports equals... The whole bridge will fall down. I need my click on. You got it, Gojetta. Time for a mix to fix that glitch. Geo Giant. I think you mean Grandmaster Assistant. <laughs> Thanks, Glitch. But looks like my team needs me after all. 